I want to personalize this. I want you to remember every week when you pull up on this land and you look up, whether you're driving onto the land alone as a single person or with a friend or with a spouse or if you have children in the car, I want you to remember when you look up and see this cross rising above everything on our land to remember that what the cross says to you personally is this. It, and I want you to say it. Every time you look up at the cross, just think to yourself, say it out loud to your children. Say, God loves me. God loves us that much. He loves us so much that he actually would go to a blood-soaked cross. He would go through infinite suffering. He would die in our place. And he would do that whatever condition that our soul, our circumstances are in. So I want you to, every time you drive onto this piece of property, look up at this cross that we're going to place and just say to yourself, as hard as it is for me to believe, God loves me that much. Okay? Got it. I got this. Whoop. Let her down. Yeah. Let her down. Got it, Eddie? Got it. Yeah, I got it. Okay. Very good. Perfect. Yes, indeed. Come on. There we go. Oh, yeah. Okay. What's up? We, so that we don't keep these gentlemen any longer. This is a moment. The cross is in place. This cross declares for all that ever drive down that road or drive by that highway that this is a Christian church and that what we believe is that our hope is not in ourselves but in the life and death of another who lived and died for us. So let's pray now together as we put this cross in place. Why don't you extend your right hand up as, as I lay mine and these gentlemen lay theirs on the cross. Dear Father, we are grateful for the beauty of this symbol. We're grateful for its witness against the sky and the hill behind it. We're grateful that it is the thing that is preeminent above everything else in this facility to speak of a reality that is not about a symbol, but about a person. And God, we're, we're grateful that you loved us so much. You gave your son that we could believe and not die, but have eternal life. Jesus, when we raise this cross, we honor what you did for each one of us, not because we deserved it or earned it, but because you were willing to give all the way through Gethsemane and Calvary for us. So Lord, please honor this day and this symbol and help this church to honor you and all that we do and say we pray in your name in the name of jesus christ amen amen thank you amen well thank you gentlemen so much